Hey guys, it's June 21st at 10.21, so my friends waited around for me, so it was so nice. So I paid off my smokes, got another card in, so I'm glad that they stayed around so then I don't have to come back tomorrow. <laughs> I've already done too much running around today. I've literally been out since 1 o'clock. And I'm just leaving now and I can't uh, upload these videos until I get home because I have no Wi-Fi. So all this area of Gastown is also haunted. So again, check out my ghost, my haunted uh, Gastown series. There's a playlist. so. Hoping to get back into that next month, hopefully. Maybe even this month, we'll see. Um, because the weather is a lot better now. It's just, I don't really like going out without money. <laughs> but if I come down here to get smokes, then usually I do like um, some ghost stories. So I am hoping to get back into that. Uh, if you guys want more ghost stories, let me know. Because that's originally what I did. And I've been out literally all day today, and I feel pretty good even though I only slept for two hours. Sorry for the traffic. It's always crazy down here. But yeah, uh, Haunted Gas Town, uh, Dark Secrets of Untold Stanley Park are two of my favorite series that I've done uh, that I need to finish off and have to do with a microphone. So hopefully, hopefully I can do that next week. Or maybe not next week, but <laughs> we'll see uh, soon <laughs> because I do have to um, do appointments too. I have met your dad. And I still have to get my COVID thing done, which I have to call tomorrow and book it, uh, the COVID shot, because I'm way overdue for that. So I have to get my depot shot done sometime next week so probably not next week but the week after i'm hoping to do ghost stories again so hopefully i'm really getting back into it because of uh twisted minds and tech Neil. um and i've been reading a lot of ghost stories so i might even do a story from home tomorrow now that i'm feeling a little better and like myself again this building behind me is also haunted and I believe I have a story on that. If not, uh, it will be coming. Or actually, no, it's not this building. It's someone upper. <laughs> but <clears throat> the coolest thing about Gas Town is that uh, I did a series for the hangings in Gas Town. And it's one of my favorite uh, stories that I've done because I didn't know that there was hangings here in the old days. So that's why I like those stories for the history. Technically, there's no proof that it, that actually happened, but I believe it. So yeah, being back in downtown and feeling like myself again, uh, I really want to get back into that again. And just waiting for the bus, so I'm smoking and telling you guys that. So I'm hoping to get back into the ghost stories from home this week and then next week, hopefully. <sighs> Somehow I gotta figure out how to do these uh, shots. Because <laughs> the depo shot makes me tired for the whole day. And COVID shot, usually I'm sick for like two weeks. So I have to plan it around when I'm not doing something. So, yeah, that's the tough part. And then with my condition, the only reason why I've been up all night tonight is because I've been running around, but I was sleeping for like non-stop the past few days, and then uh, tomorrow I'm home, I'm only going to Tysol and I'm coming back home, so I don't have a lot of money left, uh, so yeah, <laughs> but I prefer going to Tysol. 
I was really disappointed that they didn't really have anything at uh, Walmart. And I got up into getting, I guess, I don't really need to print up photos. I could always wait till next month, but just Walmart is so freaking far away. <laughs> but I was already in our Vancouver, so I just got uh, two cans of cat food and pop. I put a bell of mushrooms. I have so many mushrooms to cook up, so lots of cooking to do tomorrow too. So yeah, she actually really, really helped, and yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. I do have to get my depo shot too, so I could go talk to my doctor as well about my heart and see if that's what's causing my feet and the shaking condition. But we'll we'll see. <laughs> I mean, when it's my time to go, it's my time to go. It's not my choice. I'm here until God tells me not to be here, so. But I'm fine with that. It's getting a little easier day by day. <laughs> I'm really glad that I'm pretty much home tomorrow, so I think that's the best. So I will talk to you guys later when I get home. Like, comment, share, and I hope you guys enjoyed these videos running around with me today. This literally is sort of my whole day. <laughs> They're on unpacking stories.